Hello, beautiful, blessed beings of love and light. Natasha Monique here with your weekly June 2019 weekly Earth sign readings. This is for Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn for the week of June 2nd to June 8th. I'm using Celtic Tarot and Earth Magic Oracle cards. For personal readings, email me at tarot.tosh.balance at gmail.com or follow me on Instagram, face fear and spit, and shoot me a message. Make sure you watch your sun, moon, and rising to get a full perspective of what the week is hitting for. I'm going to full, pull five cards, full five is what I was going to say, so pull five cards, mind, body, soul, spirit, and our oracle card is the message from the universe. And this, again, is for the week of June 2nd to June 8th for Earth signs, Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn. Okay, there we go. So our message from the universe is meadow, vulnerable, vulnerable, vulnerability. <laughs> I could not get that out. Vulnerability. Allow yourself to be vulnerable. Being vulnerable does not mean you are weak. It means that you are able to ask for help when you need it. You're able to wear your heart on your sleeve. You're able to lead with your emotions, show your emotions freely and not be embarrassed by them or ashamed by them. Be vulnerable. It really does take a strong person to admit faults, to admit when they're wrong, to apologize, to really humble themselves. Humble yourselves this week, Earth Signs. Humble yourselves. So you've got some internal stuff you've got to do. We've got in our mind position, five of Athens reversed. All right, you're kidding yourself. This is where you need to be more vulnerable as well. You are... Telling, you're, you're telling yourself a lie over and over and over again, so much so that you're now believing that bullshit. It's bullshit. And you're telling yourself this lie because it makes you think that you're strong. When really, if you just tell the truth, be vulnerable, tell the truth, it'll be it just everything will be so much better. I am a big advocate on honesty. And lying to yourself is the worst person to lie to. You, you don't want to lie to yourself. You can't lie to the cards. I know you're lying to yourself. Figure it out. Admit it to yourself and then admit it to everyone else. Let that guard down for a second and allow other people to be in and say, yeah, this is actually what happens. Damn, my bad. I'm sorry. I fucked up. Admit it. Just admit it. We've got the three of atoms reversed. Next. This is causing some internal strife, but externally, you're making it seem like everything is hunky-dory. You're acting like... This is fine. This is good. That's another lie you're giving to yourself. It's acting like everything is okay, and really it's not okay. You need help. Be vulnerable and ask for that help. It's, it's okay to ask for help. It's okay for you to really just say, all right, this is affecting me in this way, shape, or form. I feel this type of way about it, and act on that. Trust me, you'll feel so much better. In your emotions, we have the King of Chalices reversed. That is really tightly holding on to your emotions. This, this story that you're telling yourself, you're really starting to believe it. You are really in your mind, in your soul, in your heart of hearts, believing this story. And the story is not, it's, it's a false story. It's a lie. You're believing your own lie, and your your emotions are paying for it. Your emotions are now scattered and all over the place, and you're popping off at any little itty bitty bit of thing because you're just not being truthful and honest with who with what's really going on and how you really feel about this situation. Allow your emotions to be set free. Allow them to be set free and really feel into it and forgive yourself. Allow yourself to be forgiven. Other people may not forgive you. That's their problem, not yours. You've got to forgive yourself. Do that internal work. Your higher self, we've got the green man. This is a risk you have to take. This is something that you have to leap forward and do. 
You've got to take this risk because it is going to just turn your world upside down. It's just going to flip everything on a 360. It's going to turn it around. Come clean. Take the risk of being seen and heard. Take the risk of allowing your emotions and your feelings to come forth. Take that risk. Go ahead and do it. There's nothing stopping you but yourself. You are the only one who is stopping you from doing this. So just readjust, reevaluate, and do what you know in your heart of hearts is the right thing to do. And that is to be honest with yourself first and then be honest with all people involved. Just be honest with it. All right, my lovelies, peace, love, and blessings to all you beautiful beings. Please do remember to like, subscribe, and share. And I will see you next time. Blessed be. Mwah.